Hello. I've got all my early potatoes sown now. All the pots are full. And what you see here are the reserves. These guys didn't make the cut. We've got pendle and javelin. We've got ooh, Winston. We've got Maris Bard. And we've got two of these. We've got two foremost. Okay. Um, so these reserves are not, uh, are not going to be planted by me this year, my pots are full. So I'm going to be giving these away over the next few years and these potatoes will get planted and they will grow on, but not by me. Okay, what's in the bag? Any ideas? If you're a subscriber and you've been watching my videos, you may have seen this bag before. We'll call it the mystery bag for those that haven't seen what's inside it and for those that have I'm going to show you um, how this has developed since oh let me just have a look at the date on here uh, yeah, uh, six weeks six weeks inside this bag let's see what we've got okay okay Six weeks ago, I'll tell you what's in anyway before I open it up, but I can tell you now something's bursting to get out. Um, six weeks ago, I deliberately knocked some chits from a seed potato. I knocked them off and put that seed potato in this bag to see if those chits would grow again and to see if any new chits would grow. And it was a small scale experiment, but I, I often wondered if a seed potato was finished once it had had its chits knocked off, either accidentally or deliberately. And so I deliberately knocked some off uh, to find out. The potato in here is called Winston. Uh, and I actually, I, I finished that video and I think the conclusion was that um, if a seed potato had its chits knocked off, uh, that it would uh, regrow some chits and it would in fact uh, the chick that had been knocked off would, would sprout again um, and so the potato stayed viable even though it had been damaged it stayed viable now so that was the conclusion and I, was, and I put this to one side and I didn't think I would see it again but when I feel this there's something going on in this bag and we need to take a look okay So, that's the seed potato that had the chits knocked off it six weeks ago. This is just some damp compost and the potato was popped back into this bag. And I think as you can see, <laughs> there are more than one, there's more than one chit on this potato now and I think you can hopefully you can see those white thread vein roots. There are roots on there. So this potato is still viable and will grow on. And in fact, I'll give this one away with the ones I've just shown you. And whoever gets them can grow this on. Let's take it out and take a closer look. Whoa. I don't think it wants to come out. I'm glad I've got this on the tray because it could make a mess. Let's give it a shake. Shake some of this off. If 
before we get it out of the bag. Okay. Oh, look at this! There's the sweet potato, you remember it? There's the number one, the circled. That was the cheat, one of the cheats I knocked off. That one definitely hasn't grown again. But the number two cheat, which is on top, uh, is under that lot. And as you can see, not only do we have cheats growing, we have roots growing. So we're going to put this one back in the bag just for the time being. It'll go with the, the other seed potatoes that haven't been planted this year. And this will be given away and this will be planted. I'm confident that this potato will grow on. Okay. Wow, look at that. What's it look like? <laughs> I'm on the wrong side of the camera as you know, so I can't tell what you're seeing here. Does it look a bit, a bit like a potato monster? <laughs> <laughs> I should have perhaps drawn a face on there. This, they, do these look like long hair? Does that look like hair growing off the back and some sort of horns sticking up at the top? And with a face drawn on there. Wow, that would look scary, wouldn't it? <laughs> anyway, we've had our fun today with this. This is homegrown veg, signing off.